And we're back with more 7 Days to Die Alpha 20. We're in the snow biome. You can see I'm nicely warm wrapped up. No, it's actually freezing as balls. It's January and it's cold. December, no snow, rain, fudge, sludge. The weather is like, oh, you want a white Christmas? Screw you, right in the face. But no, January started and everything gets freezing outside and we're gonna have a snowy January. Maybe we should have our Christmas tree out in January. But for today, we're gonna stay here in the snow biome a little longer, we're gonna do some quests. Now, the plan is to basically do a little bit of snow biome, go back to a hard night and then go into the wasteland and then do the hard night and then have that hard night be the last hard night. I'm not really sure. Let me know what you want out of each of those series. I think this one would be good to explore a little bit more of the snow biome and the wasteland and then call it a day. But we also will start the new series pretty much as we play this one. As we finish this one, we're going to start the next one. Now, the next one is either going to be Winter Soldier or it's gonna be um, farmer kicks. The farming, I'm just very curious and interested in how it works. Now for the farmer one, what we might do is actually turn off Horde Knight and use Kane's huge Horde mode. And what it does several times a day after 12 o'clock or something, it triggers um, 12 p.m. in the afternoon, um, it triggers large roaming hordes. And they come for you uh, pretty much. Like they, they know where you are, they will aim for you. Now you can avoid them obviously like by just not fighting them, but at the end of the day, that's not what this game is about. Oh my God, is that a bear or a house? Oh my cracker. Oh my balls, he's so scary pants. There's actually bears in the snow by him. Uh, Yoga is turning the corner. Yeah, you better turn the corner. Nah, you know what, I'm, I'm, I'm in, a good, in a good mood. I'm gonna let him get away today. And we have a cracker book. Oh, let's have a quick look actually in here. Just to see if we can really quickly dip in and get a couple of books. <laughs> okay, paper. Seriously, nobody reading anymore these days. Okay, we have one thing that we already knew. This is a really nice little quick slide in and out. And there we go. Hello, Mr. Lumberjack Arena. These lumberjacks are pretty hardcore when they're not feral. Like, I don't even want to know what it's like to fight a feral one, like melee. That's like really insane. Okay, do we have any drinks in here? Like a monster or something? No? Okay. Um, bye bye. One more bookshelf. Excellent, let's go. All right. Oh, hello. Bam. Let you bleed out. Let's go. Appliances and co. Oh, look at that. That is good for wrenching. But that's not where we're going. Okay, I got really excited there. Oh, I'm strong. What do we have here? Oh, look at that water. Ooh. Oh, hello there. I always like when we're about to take on a POI and there's like all these zombies showing up. Well, it's the Feral Sense. I forgot we have that on. I hope Feral Sense doesn't apply to the Pussycat. Let's not accidentally shoot the pussycat. <laughs> that would be funny. Uh, shoot it right in the ass and then have to run for my life. Oh, she's coming over. She's showing interest. That's not good. I don't like them. Nope. Nope. She's rather large as well. Okay, can we actually get up here? We can get up here. So we could theoretically take it on. You know what? Let's just do it. There we go. Hey, pussycat. Where are you going? Oh no! 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 Stupid cat! <laughs> okay, why did I do this? Okay, we have our ass. That's it. We have our ass. Okay, that's good. That's good. Okay, I was... Oh no! No! Where's she going? Where's she going? Where's she going? Come on, pussycat. Can we go on the fence? Can we go up here? There we go. Oh, yes, there we go. That is beautiful. And she's running. See that? Sissy cat. Sissy cat. Okay, you just you just run for your life. I'm waiting. I'm waiting right here for you to come back. Oh, hello. Oh, no, he's already he's already dead. Got it right in the face. There we go. Beautiful. Ow, 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 oh no! Oh my god, a dire wolf, are you absolutely friggin' kidding me? All right, let's get some heat into us. I hope this is hot, I mean, it's fire. I hope it's heating us up. And then get our bag back. Now our bag is gonna be a, a challenge and a half because it's right in the middle of dogs. Yeah, of course, Direwolf. There we go. 
Okay, we have the pussycat here. Yeah, we're gonna have to jump up on the roof. And let's see how we're gonna do that. Oh, can we reach it? Oh, we can't. Damn it. Okay, we're gonna have to somehow open it. I don't know how we're gonna do this, guys. I have no idea. Okay. 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 <laughs> I jumped on the wolf's ass and he was all like, oh, what? what? <laughs> you dumbass! Oh, there we go. Beautiful. Oh, okay. I think it was actually the zombie that hit me rather than the, the dire wolf, but dire wolf down. That's great. Okay, genie, macaroni, guys. What is with the friskiness? There's some meat for days. I love it. And I think the dogs are gone. I don't know where the dogs are gone to. All right, let's do it. I'm not even going to double dip because I'm kind of already fearing what's going to happen. Okay, let's do it. I don't think this is going to be possible silent because of the feral sense, but I did put a point into sneak, to be honest. So theoretically, we might be able to be quiet. And there we go. We already have zombies coming in from the outside. That is not fair. Oh, he's already dead. Okay. I didn't even see this guy. Das Dreckstück! Okay. Oh, hello there. Oh, he's a feral crawler. I haven't seen that before. Oh, what is wrong with me today? Today I'm a little bit all over the shop. I'm a little bit too excited about everything because of all the new seasons that I'm thinking of, all the new gameplays. It's always very exciting. Hello there, my friend. Do we have any drinks here? Let's actually drink something. And there we go, a little bit of coffee to keep the energy up. Okay, let's go. We already cleared the kitchen. We're just gonna leave the light on, that's fine. We're gonna do more stealth um, at night and I think we still need more points because I have, from the Shadows 3, I need, oh, I actually have a point, so let's put it in there. Excellent, so let's see, let's see. Hmm, okay, I think we might have to actually go up there. Yeah, okay. Yeah, of course. Oh, this is also a... A quest to turn on the lights at night. Nice. Let's get their legs. Ah! Okay. What do we have in the toolbox? And let's go here. I love the way that it actually breaks as you stand on it. Okay. Shh, 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 shh. Zombie detection mode. Before we loot anything, there's the loot bag. Let's see where the zombies are. Okay. Yeah, it's upstairs now, the bag. Oh, may oh what do we have here? Nice. Oh, they all woke up just now. No, they didn't. We just see the red dots. Okay. <sighs> Shit.
Let's open the main loot. What do we get? Oh, baby, I love it. Look at this, a truck accessory schematic. Are you joking? Nice. Oh, this is, I'm, I love it. Absolutely love it. Yeah, so once you miss an arrow and you hit like glass or something, everybody wakes up, of course. Okay, so let me see, where is the bag? The bag is here, but oh, it's right above us, I think. Where is it? It's right here somewhere. Ah, there we go. All right, we got it. Medical supplies? Yes! Oh, we might actually want to use that. Let's get those chests. What is our loot stage actually right now? 124. Love it, love it, love it. Oil shale, okay. Yeah, that's all for sale. Loads of plastic here, loving it. We have some oil barrels here. We're not gonna open up yet until uh, we finish looting, so we can take them on. Nice. And the car loot, let's see what we have. Oh, look at that, another ratchet. Yeah, we can scrap that, baby. And oh, a machine gun schematic, that is nice. We're not using any machine guns in this play, but look at this, we get steel tool parts now, that is so cool. And here we have one of my favorites. It's not the electric one, but it's the working tool stiffy car. Let's take that as well. Nice blocks. Basic lights, nah. Let's just scrap them if we can. Can we scrap them? Ah, oh, we're just gonna drop them. Don't care. Let's see what we have in here. Nice repair kits. Oh, that is amazing. Really enjoying the loot in this winter biome so far. Okay, this we can actually take apart for engines. Um, oh, did we only get one engine? Yeah, sometimes you get more than one, I think. Is that a dot? I think it is. Yeah. Ah, nothing interesting in there. Oh, look at that. I did not know that. That can also be taken apart. Beautiful. Yeah, these pipes can be taken apart as well, of course. So that always was the case, but we don't seem to be getting much for them. And then we have something under here. Another toolbox. A wiring tool. Okay. I don't think we have one here. And uh, we can open this now, I think. And that's where the wolf and the dog was, which again... Oh, the dog is still there. Oh. Good. Dogs cannot come up ladders. I like it. So the joke is on them. We tricked them. <laughs> yes. That was my plan. That was my plan. I knew that. Okay, let me see what we have in those three cars. Can we wrench these? Oh, we can. What do we get from them? Do we get any parts? Oh, we get some mechanical parts. Very nice. What about these guys here? More mechanical parts? Yes. Perfect. Oh, that's beautiful. And um, let's get this car as well. I just noticed... Oh, electric car. I just noticed that I forgot my bicycle. I don't know why. i just so used to walking everywhere. Okay, we're going to scrap this. We can sell the parts, we're gonna keep that, and we have two... Yeah, let's read them. End of story. Let's read them both. Get that little bit of experience. It doesn't really matter at this stage. Like, they're, they're, they're just taking up a space for, like, a hundred tukes, like... Uh, how about I empty your pockets? Oh, sugar butts. Nice. We're gonna buy that. that Basil at first aid. Monitor of cocktails? Not gonna say no to smell. that. We definitely Got need it. that for Heart Night. Yeah, let's do that. And let's see what jobs you have. We're gonna get tier three jobs hopefully soon. Um, fetch and clear, Look, very close by, I love it. All right, sugar bats, take it with us. 
by the red tea as well. Might as well. All right, we're just cooking up a little bit of food, getting ourselves warmed up, and then we're gonna head out to do the next quest, next quest during the night. And it's a tier two quest, so it should be interesting. We're gonna take our goggles and we're gonna be trying to be as stealthy as possible. We're doing this mission here during the night in the postal office, but before we go, you will see that I changed the night vision goggles. They now have a red tint like Darkness Falls because I used the modlet from Kane's to change the color. You can definitely see the difference if you turn the lights on. That is with lights and that is without the helmet lights. So it's now putting a red tint on it. Now, the only downside is that if we put it down here, the night vision goggles and turn them on, they actually don't get the red tint. They just make everything bright. I don't know why that is. So we're gonna wear them instead and leave the glasses at home. So let's go. Let's quickly loot this car. There is really crappy loot in these cars sometimes. You, there should be a minimum of crap. If you have loot stage 124, I think the worst loot you should ever be able to find in here is, say, loot stage 50. Something like that. Okay, let's do this. Now, we have to be careful because we still can be seen, of course, uh, because the... Ma uh, sorry, we still can be seen by zombies outside because of the light. Oh, that's nice. Is this the official way in? There's no door here. I mean, this like looks like the official way in, to be honest. Um, can we jump? Yes, because we have the parkour skill. There's no zombie in here. Now, this also could wake up uh, the zombies, of course, because you, you loot. But we, I think, are pretty low, actually, on our ninja noises. Oh, there we go. I can see Karen. Oh, blue dye. That's my favorite color. Very good. That was a nice right in the back of the four-face stab. Oh, is this where the loot is? Ah, somebody woke up. No, I can see you. Okay, there's nobody else in here. How loud is it if you wrench this chair? It's not as loud. It sounds louder than it actually is. Did you see those reflexes? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Ass in the air, dude. American dad. My funny is so high in the air right now. <laughs> okay, let's do this. Okay, excellent. Now, how do we get up to the roof? Oh, excellent. We might get some meds here. And no, we don't need any healing. Fine. Let me see what we got here. Oh, beautiful. Oh, genie, Mark, you couldn't be any louder, dude. God. It's just got nonsense here. Okay, we're gonna have to go up on the roof. Okay, is there an underground somewhere? Because th this is literally it. Oh, there could be somebody in here. Unless both of these buildings are part of this. That could of course be it. Relax, relax, relax. Don't panic, don't panic, don't panic. That's the main thing, don't panic. I'm a little bit at a loss right now. Whatever that was. 
Oh, yes, baby. Scrap chest armor. Actually, we're going to take that in case we get infectinated. So we don't get infectinated. Nice. Okay, I just took a whole look around and I just cannot find any more zombies here. Oh, whoops. Yeah, these zombies don't count. That's just because of feral sense. So I wonder, do we have to jump across? Is that the official way that you would jump into here and then go into the backyard? Is that it? Smells like dogs here. I can see somebody there. Why is that rubbish? Oh, that's rubbish. Oh, here we go. Oh, come on. Yes. We don't seem to be going too far away. Definitely not. Oh, it actually hit him in the head. Fair play. There's a chest, but is that... It, it has to be. But there's a generator in this building and in the other building, so... Maybe in the tier 2 you have two generators you have to turn on? Could be. Oh, Christ. Okay, we lost a lot of health, but that's okay. Let's um, heal up. I did not think that this and this POI were connected at all. All right, I mean, we killed everybody now. So we did some of it um, with the new spy goggles, <laughs> which are nice, actually. Okay, let's do this. Nice. Ooh, yes, what do we find? Oh, yeah. Oh! oh! That is so perfect. This is just so... <gasps> I love you so much right now. Okay. Now we're talking. The machete is going to be my new knife. Okay, so let's take this out. Put these guys in here. And now we got ourselves a machete. Construction site create nine glue. Oh, that is just sexy. Hello, where's that coming from? Also, let's put another bandage on and let's try out that machete, baby. Okay. Oh. Oh. It's like being reunited with your long lost son. Okay, let's see if you bleed to death as you bleed. Oh, it did apply the bleed. It did apply the bleed. Oh, I love it. I love it so much. Do you know when you find that special someone and you just look at the reflection of your face and its blade, you just know it's meant to be. <laughs> oh, I like it. Can we put that onto our crossbow? Okay, let's see. Is that... Um, oh, I like that I actually can go up here. That's, like, awesome. Let's see what we've got. Sure, why not? Let's get to the trunk. Let's go. We already have you. We already own you. That's okay. Let me leave you here. Take that. and Explosives. Yes. It's definitely one of the playthroughs I want to do is Explosive Expert, where we literally will be only using big guns. My favorite would be shotguns and demolition, but the problem is that this is strength and this perception, and I don't know if... It, if it, I suppose you could always go between two trees, like in this case, Boomstick 
and a demolition expert would just be absolutely fantastic. I could just see that be a very great combination, like full automated shotgun and anything that makes big kabooms. Oh, yes. Thank you. Awesome, baby. Strength increased by one makes it four. Does that mean we can put another sexy Sauras in here? No, but it only it means we only need one point actually to get to level five. That's even better. Okay, let's wrench all that stuff and then go home. gonna get for sale. Uh, iron knuckles and iron chest and the hunter's journal bears can be vicious extremely hard to kill yes 10 percent more damage to bears definitely yes absolutely okay let's do it we're, we're gonna have to get to tier three. Oh, it's day 25 that actually means the inventory reset oh a cement mixer for six thousand. oh and now there is a machete schematic oh that means we could craft a better <laughs> machete. <laughs> oh, that is good. Ranger's Guide. Exploding arrows. Oh my god, why is there so much awesome stuff right now? Okay, we're gonna have to collect all the things we want to sell and have to come back here. Okay, I have everything I want to sell on me and I'm even selling some electronic and mechanical parts. I'm actually taking all these cards, uh, cars apart and sell everything that I get from them as well. Well, except the gas, which is really not worth selling. Like we're better off using that for ourselves. So, but uh, even springs, all that stuff, these things we're better off scrapping and then selling. Um, an engine, I have three more engines. That battery is full health that we got. It's worth a lot of money. So that definitely will count. Okay, there's one more car here. Let's have a quick look. Yeah, we're not gonna sell that. Hang on to that. So, but any more engines we get from this, we're definitely going to sell. This could potentially give us more engine. Oh, there's a grill and an engine. Very good. I love it. And another battery, maybe? Nope, that's it. All right, let's take the sugar butt. And let's see what we get. Now, let's see if you have any mods. A structural brass mod for 400. In a shotgun mod, we don't have a gun, but we have a knife. So 486, let's take that. 486, that's 486 again. That's 486 again. Let oh, the door hit you I forgot to out. take the money out of the bicycle. Hang on a second. So 486, if we can get everything else to increase by 486, then that's fine. So let me see. 486. That went up to... 1053 okay it actually went up exactly by 486 now if we put the second one in it's 486 again so that means we're not actually getting any bonus and then 225 that's 486 again so we didn't get any bonus at all actually for this ah that's depressing so this only works then on items which are level six but that's steel knuckles at level five that's fully repaired steel knuckles at well least at least we didn't make a loss off your boots before you come okay into my so shop. let's um sell this let's sell this I think we should definitely get a cement mixer. That there should be not even a question about it. The gunpowder is something we definitely need. It's only 45. Exploding arrows and crossbow bolts. That's just a must. Electric fences is nice, but more important is the machete schematic. So we're going to do that. We're going to get the um, electric fence schematic so we can start crafting them ourselves. We should get the steel arrows. 700 concrete mix. I definitely think we should get 500. Let's do it. And that's only 225. Hell yeah, we're going to get that. That's it. That good and you don't even I think that was a really nice shopping spree. 
So let's use the ranger guy to archery to get those exploding uh, crossbow balls. Let's do the machete because I think the machete schematic is not something we can unlock through perks. Um, I don't think... Actually, I should have checked that first. That, that's on me. Does that unlock the machete down here? You're a samurai. You inflict big wounds, bleeding. It doesn't mention that, you, that it unlocks the machete. No, it just says that it unlocks here the knife crafting, unlocks hunting knife. Yeah, it doesn't seem to unlock anything else. So we definitely did the right thing there, I think. Um, then, of course, fences. And that was a very good buy. I can't wait to get back home to base to start um, making lots of concrete. So let's have a look and see what we need for fences. Forged iron. Yeah, we need to do loads of forged iron. And then what else do we do? Exploding. We're going to do the exploding um, crossbow bolts. Oh, the polymer as well. Gunpowder, duct tape, steel arrowheads. Very nice. I love it. All right, guys. I think I'm going to leave this here for this episode. However, uh, when we're back next time, we're going to do that quest. Hand it in in the morning if we need to and wait the night and maybe just loot a couple of random buildings while we wait if, uh, if the uh, trader is close to hand it in. But we're going to go back to the forest biome we're going to start getting into the cement we're going to start mining more and more for iron and we're going to get everything done i'm also going to go and take the street lamps here i'm actually going to do this now we're going to take the street lamps and we're going to take them apart because they give us uh, steel like these guys these guys here should give us one to two steel there we go This is actually just metal now. So these guys are no longer pieces. And over here, yeah, this is just metal now. These guys here, they still give us electrical parts, but only iron as well. Just really quickly check the satellites. And nope, no steel. All right, yes, I'm going to leave it here. Thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, remember to kick that like button in the balls, and I hope to see you guys in the next video. And if you're new to the channel and you like what you see, hit that subscribe button. And I'll see you guys next time. Until then, as always, fuel spaß and happy gaming.